You've never actually lost a set. Not that I remember. Battlefield, of course. That's standard in this matchup. Well, this set, this usually just starts on Battlefield or Dreamland. Um, no, not Dreamland anymore. They did that. For no, 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 I'm not talking about like oh, these, these players. Two. Oh, I'm talking yeah, about the, yeah. the matchup. Yes, yes, this yeah. matchup. Sometimes it starts on Yoshi's actually. Uh, depending so, on the ICs. Yeah, like, and depending on the Fox. Yeah. Because um, some, like, I understand like why they do it, just because they want to like close the gap um, with Fo against Fox. Really, foxes that are willing to play on the platforms, they can be very hard to catch. Yeah, they can be very hard to catch on Yoshi's too, though. Because mm -hmm. mm. you can move around the platform yeah. faster. It's true. It's true. It's a pick, it's a pick your poison. Oh, these dash chances. Yeah, I like that up smash. Mojo's telling me that he thinks up smash is like amazing in this matchup. But up smash is just amazing, dude. Up smash is very good. I think it's very risky, though, still. It is, uh, especially like, at low percents. But it's the reward is so yeah, good. Yeah, it's good. It's good for sure. I think uh, it's... You gotta, you gotta pick your spots. You gotta pick your spots for sure. Cause like, if they crouch cancel you or shield you, you could just be dead. Oh, of course. But that's like a lot of things. That's a lot of things. With that's a lot of things. But there, have... are, there are obviously things that are safer, like that you can whip punish with. Yeah, like jumping. And, yeah. And like, or... like running shine or something. Yeah. But it's about risk reward. Yeah. You gotta figure that out for yourself. Sometimes you just gotta go for the risky business. Ooh. Ooh. What happened? Mojo took the first stock and then it all went downhill. I don't know, dude. He's playing against Nanners. Nanners is good about sneaking his way into a really big lead. Sure. Like, sometimes I'll be like, wow, this is, like, really even. I killed this Nana, and, like, it's, like, I feel like it's even, and then he's up, like, a whole stock, and this, and this Popo is just pumping. Ooh. Super good. Make C on Saturdays. Ooh. It's probably not going to change. Probably not. Which I understand. <laughs> the the update. Good double shine. shine. Yep. Get the shine spike on Anna. That was super clean. But I feel like Connor, with the way it's been going, Connor might just close it out with the Sopo. Good. That's like the big problem as of late for Mojo is like his Sopo has been closing out the stocks. Yeah, Mojo gives him a lot See? of free shit. Yeah. It's got to be a little more patient sometimes. But it can be shine. difficult. Oh, misses it. Connor like drifted back. That's probably it. Oh, no. Oh, that was a super good recovery. Slides off and then back airs him. Yeah, that yeah, might good be. edge cancel, but we got the shield drop out. Fair. Oh, my gosh, dude. Connor's just chipping at him, doing all this little damage. He's got to play better around the Sopo, dude. Me included, every Fox here sucks against Sopo for some reason. It's interesting. They're, like, better against the... They're better against both the climbers. Yeah. You're, you're good at, like, gimping the Nana, but then you actually have to deal with the Sopo at some point. Yeah. It's hard. I like these shield drops. You should move into the platforms. Takes the risk to hit his shield. I like it. Because it's like it's like if he doesn't get the shield grab, because Connor's going to go for it there. Yeah, for uh, sure. Wow, Nana's just jabbing him. Oh, yeah. Shine him back into Popo. Nice. That's not it, though. Yeah. Sopo's still Very well could be it, though, soon. Either one of them. Ooh, I like the forwarder actually. Uh oh, this is bad. Yeah. Oh, that was nice. He teched in. That Good was wait. like the worst tech, tech in you could do there. I thought the get up attack was gonna cost him. Same. Um, because he could have just like probably got up and up smashed, but uh, he read the tech roll, which was really nice. Good stuff to if, Uncle Mojo. If he con if he, if Connor like tech rolled any other way, he probably would have gotten back into neutral. Yeah, if he would have just teched in place. And just like waited at center just stage. Just regular get up. Here. Yeah, yeah. He had a, he had a pretty strong position, but get on Mojo to uh, to read what, or at least just prepare for what Bananas is going to do. All right, FD, of course. Oh, I like that he ju uh, jumped in shine, but didn't jump away. He jumped forward. To, yeah. Like, jump over the up air. That was nice. Bananas dead. Nice. Okay. He's holding stage super well right now. Double jab. Yeah, he jumps forward, but he actually gets rewarded for it. Connor usually back airs that. I'd say Connor isn't playing 100% right now on this league. We'll see. See what happens. 
Bojo's also playing really good today, dude. He is. Yeah, he doesn't SDI that. <coughs> yeah, Connor, Connor doesn't Connor. use that setup all the time, mm -hmm. so it's really weird, you know? Like, sometimes you'll just get hit by it because you don't expect him to do it. You know what Mojo does when he gets wobbled is he practices tech skill. Interesting. Yeah, which I find really cool, actually. He's, like, getting wobbled, and he just, like, acts like he's moving around. Ooh, that ledge dash. Slick. Super fast. And now it's like a mix-up, because you never know when Mojo's going to ledge dash. He might just, like, up air from ledge or something weird. It's true. Ooh, good mash. So now, like, connor has got to keep that in mind. That's going to be it, though. He, like, didn't get out of the scramble. A lot of the time, with like, if you're about to get wobbled, you just got to get out of the scramble. Yeah, you, he needs to buffer roll more in that situation. Or just, like, or just get out jump of there. away. Yeah. Honestly. I think roll is, is in that situation, just because you're on FD, jumping can be a little more dangerous. Um, yeah, but either way, he needed to do something. Yeah, yeah. Something in a retreating fashion. Yeah. The way the, the only reason why I say jump is because you get further away. Yeah, you can definitely can. With a roll. Jump is just... It's it's very scary on FD. But gotcha you gotta do something. Yeah. Good wave dash out. So I think Hamilton and Espot play? Yeah, they do in Lizard Simmies. Nice. That was a really slick Nana kill. Yeah, was super nice. Ooh, I like that up tilt, dude. Just trying to catch him. Ooh! Look at all this dashing. Dude, oh my gosh. They're scrambling right now. He's going for the grab. He's really fishing for it right now. Because it's, it's FD. He wants that he wants that nice clean combo of the up throw. All right, this is an edge guard situation. Yeah, Mojo always like goes high. He never like goes straight to the ledge, and like Connor doesn't even have to respect that option, you know? Yeah, for like, sure. Like if you see, like Connor edge guards him a lot, and he literally just stands on the stage. He doesn't even ever like cover the unreactable by grabbing the ledge. Yeah. Because yeah. it's like he knows. Mm -hmm. He knows he's not gonna go to ledge. And going to ledge is a really good option. It is. Like, Especially really if you're good. good at ledge dashing. Yeah. I go that to was ledge. really I go to weird. Ledge way too much, dude. <laughs> I love recovering the ledge. Oh, is Ooh, that a wobble? Nice. Yeah. Got the handoff too. Dude, that was sick. That was clutch by Connor. The handoff, that was weird. I, I guess he knew. Uh, he didn't know, but he reacted in time after he threw. Connor gets a lot of handoffs that way, actually. That no, most ice climbers wouldn't get just because he can react so fast, actually. I want Connor to win because he plays with Rumble on. He is a Rumble boy. You SGJ is also a Rumble boy. Yeah, he is. You don't like Rumble, do you? I just don't like the way it feels. I like. I get the appeal of Rumble. I just, just don't and, like and, it. And it's definitely like not even. It's only. It's only helpful. You know, yeah. there's nothing hurtful about it. But it definitely, you know, is. It, it's definitely not. For it's everybody. just. It's a preference did thing. He, did you read that roll with a short hop up there? <laughs> Looks like it. Nice. Ooh, I like it. Yeah, he's just gonna rinse and repeat Edge Guard now. Tonga's just gonna have to recover like high. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Oh, but he chips him and then he wall jumps? Okay. That was nice. Yeah, that was super good. Yeah, he's cleaning it up again against Sopa more now. Ooh, could be it. That is it. <laughs> Taken out of context, people mashing, if you just cam it, to, if you just put the camera on somebody mashing, yeah, it could look really wrong. I would agree. I would definitely agree. Ooh, good grab. I almost got the jab grab there. Ledge. Nope. Still off stage. Oh, I like that shield drop back there. Just pushing it. Like, even if... So the thing is, if you, if you do the aerial low, they can't just shield grab it. And uh, if you hit their shield, they'll probably get pushed back. Because I see yeah. have the traction. Just, their traction's crazy. Yeah. It's like it's Luigi. True. There, yes. It is similar to Luigi in that way. 
Luigi's crazy, dude. I don't understand that character. Yeah, honestly, I think uh, Connor should pick up Luigi for the Fox matchup. I think he should pick up Luigi for the Puff matchup. Icy's beat Fox. Luigi does do better against Puff than Ice Climbers do. That is true. And uh, I think she, uh, yeah, well, he definitely does better against Peach. If, if played right, that matchup looks legitimately impossible. Puff Ice Climbers? Yeah. Yeah, no, I would agree. Like, I don't understand how Connor has managed to beat SDJ. Like, well, I mean, the met, the met, the sets were like SJ is super committed to blinking. It looks impossible. Dude, it's crazy. I don't understand it. Like, gosh, it looks awful to play. The biggest thing, it just looks un un Yeah, dude. Like, you're not even interacting. Like, it's it just looks very unfun to deal with. But he makes it work sometimes. By the way, come to my bi weekly. Oh, hello, Chudat. The Chronicles, dude. Nice. Very likely, is it? Yeah. Good up air. That's the mix-up. You can either you can either back air them off again, or you can confirm the kill with the up air if they're at a high percent. But yeah. like, if they if you only up air, they can just SDI it. Yeah, for sure. And ICs have, are really good at SDI, or like SDIing up air. Mm -hmm. weird. It's weird how characters some characters are really good at it, and some aren't. Yeah, some characters are just easier with. It's hard with the fast fallers, dude. That and I don't even have to do it that often because I don't get up throw up air unless I'm at a really high percent. Yeah, you're just not you're also not as used to it. And that requires somebody outplaying me in neutral, which was you know, never happened. Yeah, that's never happened ever. Ooh, Ooh missed it. Just got that crazy handoff though. Got the edge cancel. Last stock, he's landing in front of him. Oh wow, no! Oh god. <laughs> Rip. Mm -mm. All right. Going back to Dreamland, probably. He should go Yoshi's. Oh, he's Orange Fox now. I don't think he meant to. Everybody's least favorite fox color. Is this everybody's least favorite fox color? It's a lot of people's least favorite. It's either this or green. This is my least favorite. If he just didn't have yellow boots, I hate would the be. yellow boots. Everything I think the brown pants are sick though. And the jacket. I like the, the orange color actually. I don't, I don't like. I I don't like it, but that's just because I don't like orange. Um, but I think it's a good orange. Dude, if, if White Fox had, like, the black pants or brown pants, that would be, like, the coolest skin in the game. <laughs> Who knocked Bungo out of the tournament? Uh, SDJ. Okay. Thor beat him in winners. Yeah, that's that's weird. Yeah, and then SJJ. Uh, Back throw shine. Burr throw shine. Burr Brad throw shine. shine. Burr hard R shine. Burr, throw, Burr hit the Burr throw shine on Nox on Noxty today. It was very sad. Really? Were the games close? The games were very close. Noxty was up the whole time on game one. It was He was he respawned. Burr was at 70%. I was like, David, you got it. And you know what happened next? He got Back throw shine. He ran to the corner. He didn't just get Back throw shine. <clears throat> what? Between who? Me and you? Me and Hamlin? Yeah, yeah, Hamlin won. Uh, David runs to the corner, gets grabbed, back thrown onto Randall, misses the tech, shines, gets hit into the wall, misses the tech again, and dies. Oh, that's sad. It was very, very sad. And then he had a very close game, too, but he still lost. Yeah, he's good against Fox. He is good against Fox. But he got seduced. Yeah, Burr's pretty good. If you don't know what you're doing versus Burr, you're in for a world of trouble, dude. Mm -hmm. Especially at the ledge. Sure. Like, I've learned to literally just dash dance in center for, like, ages, dude. That's what I've learned to do against, like, everybody here. Like, that's, like, that's, like, at the mid-level. Is I literally just have to dash dance in center. Like, did you see my set versus Palpo? Like, I just have I to did. dash dance a ton. I did. You got the whiff punishes? Set to wait. Oof. Dude, he's got to get this back air. Yeah. yeah, I know he wants a back air right now. Bananas probably knows it too. He's getting back aired. <laughs> it's hard to not get back aired. Broken move. Ices are pretty heavy, right? Yeah, they're actually heavier than Marth. Surprisingly enough. They're just more floaty? 
They are more floaty, yeah. Okay. But they're like one unit heavier than Mark. So we'll die at the top earlier. Ooh, okay, this is bad for bananas. I like that reverse drill. Interesting. Yeah, get up attack. Connor was ready for it, but Nana got hit. Down tilt, shine. Another shine? Yep, that's it for Nana. And he's just gonna, yeah, it's, that's it, he's done. Game five. Not surprised. Nothing shocks me anymore. That's not true. Oh yeah? <laughs> up smash is sick, dude. Tries to go for the up throw, but Bananas is ready, and he got the grab. Wait, what? What happened? I don't know. Because he needs to, like, reset his controller. These players are weird. What's happened? Controller, Johns. Good mash. Oh, he landed right in front of him. Mm -hmm. That's a wobble. Yeah. Every day of the week, dude. Indeed. Connor's setups are really good. Annoyingly good. He's very good at setting up into them. That was good DI. It was, but he was dead regardless in that situation it looked like. A little less percent, he might have not been. Or if he was a task, but... Could be. Yeah, he's gotta get under him. I kinda like to treat like, Sopo like getting under Sheik. You know, where it's just like, I'm trying to shark. Yeah, for sure. Because like, the aerial mobility is not very good. It's not at all. Ooh, Nana with the taunt. She's invincible though. Definitely is. Oh, that cross up was scary. Yeah. I think he could have shield grabbed that. Maybe. It's hard to say. Damn, she back. She's been back there a lot. Mm -hmm. Connor's been getting the follow up off of it most of the time though. Yeah, though I think that was like the first one he's just like outright not reacted to. That must feel bad, dude. You join the corner once and you just na your nana gets gimped. Back there, this yeah. characters get to ki uh, like oh, invisible ceiling. Ices get gimped a lot more than you think. Yeah. They even live a really long time where they get gimped. Is what generally happens. Nintendo got gimped a lot in the set with hacks. That is true. <coughs> hacks did ledge dash into shine a fair bit. Yeah. What do you think Mojo's thinking right now, dude? I never know what's going through his mind. I have no idea. I might be thinking about Fifth Element. We're gonna be thinking about Fox. Maybe he's thinking about you. Probably. Oh, the clank! Yeah, that was oh, good. That was get good up to attack. no tech, actually. Interesting. And then and another get up attack. Get up attack's broken, dude. I don't care what. Get up attack and spot dodging are not as bad as people think they are, dude. They're just risky. They're just risky. Like everything. But like, yeah, that's literally like everything nowadays, dude. Everybody kills you for literally everything, so might as well go balls deep. It's a mix-up. Do something weird. <laughs> um, Connor's not winning because he's not wearing the Nog tag. You did wear the Nog tag today. Ooh, that's rough. Ledge called it. Usually when a fox up B is at like that height, they're ready to go to the ledge. Like Yeah, for sure. I know they I've been there and I know like that's when I'm ready to just go to the ledge. It's a safe spot. Up being there, you just have so many options. Mm -hmm. Last stock game five. Him with the down smash. He's in the corner. That's not good for him. Lots of damage. Ooh. 
I like that falling up air. Let's see how far you can take it. Ah, I lost positioning. Yeah. That's rough. All right, he's gonna stick to these platforms. Oh, good weight. Ah, that back air was nice. Oh, but he misses that. Ooh, Got the poke. Spaghetti, dude. Oh. He's gotta kill Nana now. Yeah. Ooh, that was super good. Connor can do this. Connor can very well do this with the way Sopo has been playing. Ooh. But that's it. Got the crash cancel forward tail on the jab, actually, which is interesting. All right, so we're getting SFOP. SFOP uh, Hamlin. I'm down.